Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda, where today I think we're gonna do what I was wanting to do, or what I was thinking about doing last time, before I, well, before I did the Sorry arc, which is the Krogan homeworld thing. Don't, don't frame skip on me now, thank you. First we're gonna check our email. Uh huh. From Cora, I mean it, thank you. Still sorting through everything, but it's easier since we talked. Sarissa owes us for this, but she owes us Shara's memory even more. I still feel like an idiot, you know, hanging on to her every word. But I'll get over it. Friends take the sting out of it. Meantime, let's hit some bad some bad guys, shall we? Cora. Okay, Sarissa... I, I, I think Cora did hang on to her too much, but I think... So, whatever... All the things Sarissa said still stand. Like, her tactics and everything, they're, they're good. They really are. So it's not like everything is for naught or anything, and I think she legitimately made the best decision to save Morasari rather than... I mean, her job was to protect Ishara. Um, that was That's what the meaning of the word was that she was for the bodyguard. But, like, in the end, I think she made the right decision. Who's Sid? Oh, hey, hey, Ryder. It's Sid. Wanted to say thank you for coming to help me. I like the say thanks for saving my carapace. I guess you didn't know it was me at the start, huh? But that's why it's great. I didn't tell you anything. My bad. Sorry, but you went ahead and helped anyway, even though you knew it was probably going to be dangerous. You put yourself out there for other people, and that's why you're the Pathfinder. No, our Pathfinder. And thanks for having Vetra's back. I know you're there for her, which means she can be there for me. That means a lot. Don't tell her I said this. You're awesome. Heading home. From Lieutenant Hyderia. Hey, Ryder, remember me, Hyderia? We talked about that nice outpost of yours while I was taking care of evacuees from our Ark. Not anymore, though. We're heading home. With Lithuania back at the Nexus, they've got people and shuttles to get us back there. They're saying none of it would have happened without you. I believe them. Thank you for everything. Oh, cool. That nice outpost of yours. Thank you. Oh, and I was going to read... Uh, crew like no other. You core become confidants. We've become, we've become close friends after the events on Ark Lithuania. You and Cora chose to keep Sarissa, Sarissa's, Sarissa Terrace's secret that she sacrificed her predecessor, Matriarch Ishar, while facing the Ket. This decision has clearly been painful for Cora. I understand. I understand. Maybe it wasn't the right decision for Cora's sake to do that, but at the. Justice, justice will come around to Sarissa in time. Plus, she lives a super long time, so it'll get there. Hmm. <laughs> but let's go. We did parking orbit. I like it. It's purple. Me scan. scan complete. Yay, scan complete. Okay, out we go. Um, yeah. Going all the way across the system. There's not as much scourge out here. But I guess there's probably no safe way to enter the system. And, you know, theoretically, if the Quarians and stuff were still coming, which they're not because they've officially announced no DLC for this game, which just breaks my heart. Detected. But, uh... Yeah, anyway. Uh, what? Wait, controller, come on. Move. Okay. Um, Tracking a huge mineral deposit. We'd have to. I, I would think we want to try to get something out to them because we're closer on this side. You know, we'd be like, hey, because they weren't too far behind us. I think. Be like, hey, be careful. <laughs> but you know, I think I saw something that they were gonna explore the fate of the quarry and art, etc. In uh, what like comics and novels instead of DLC, which I kind of don't want to talk about because it kind of just, it legitimately kind of makes me want to cry, but, which I know sounds silly, but it's like, I don't know, I don't know, it's just sad. Although I did see something, a, a, a tweet from Casey Hudson that the Mass Effect series is not done. That they'll be back with a vengeance or something. So we still, I guess we still have that. Because I, 
was like, if No Man's Sky is still active, they're still putting out updates for No Man's Sky, and that was an even bigger flop on Pawn release, you know? And I don't even think Andromeda flopped. I think people just got really upset about minor things like anime. Like, animation really isn't that big of a deal. It's not. Animation was just the way, just the, just, just the, the most obvious thing that people latched onto to be pissed off about a game that didn't re match their standards, you know. Which, in a lot of ways, it didn't match what I, it didn't match what I wanted. Doesn't mean it's not a good game, you know. I kind of wish they had been able to go with their original plan, which was to create, you know, like a Mass Effect One system where there were hundreds of planets, you know, or, you know, theoretically hundreds of planets you could land on, and that each one had a bit more stuff going on than it did in Mass Effect 1. Like, I love doing the planet exploration in 1. I just kind of wanted the planets to have a little more on them. They had a nice variety of, like, you know, lava and ice and, you know, all this other stuff, but there wasn't, and some of them were green, and some of them had, some of them even had plants and animals, you know, and it was cool, and I wanted a little bit more of that. That's what I wanted. It's not what I got. I still like what I got, you know? But yeah, I do feel, I do feel like EA forced Bioware to sort of, a, a, not abandon this project, but to not put their best effort into this, and they wasted time on Anthem when Anthem's never gonna be able to compete with Overwatch, basically, is how I feel, you know? Or like, I don't know, Call of Duty, you know? As stupid as I think Call of Duty is. <laughs> but like, I mean, it's not stupid, but it's boring. I think it's boring. Like, why would you wanna play a realistic shooter? Like, that, I don't know. It's just not my thing. I don't understand. It's fine. It's fine if people like it. I don't. But yeah, I don't know. It's just not gonna compete with with the existing ones, or with big ones like Overwatch that have a ton of fan support, you know? It's just, it's not, it's not new enough, it's not, it's, Overwatch kind of was stood out from the crowd because of its art style and like all the crazy abilities that you have, you know, and like, it's character, it's a character based multiplayer, like, oh, like a shooter game, first person shooter. Which is like Team Fortress, but newer and more interesting, I think. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, sorry. Sorry for the tangent. Oh, wait. Um, actually, I did last time. Um, no. Oh, B is confirmed loadout. Oh, well. I'll just have to go back in. Sorry, I forgot that, I don't know, I don't know what I was trying to do there. Shh. I don't know what I was trying to do there at that particular thing. I could have changed what I wanted there, but I was like, brr. I guess I'll just hit up, uh, I'll hit up a station out here, maybe. Hello, desert planet, it's been a while. Oh, hey, a, a cash. Oh, but yeah, I put the points into Soldier that let me get the fourth item I can carry. Wait, where'd it go? Terminal. Loadout. Well, let's bring Drac. Uh, Drac and... Hmm. Maybe Jaw? Might be interesting. Nope. Give me the loadout. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Do I have any other shotguns? Ooh. What is that? It's not as good damage. The rate of fire is higher, and the clip size is higher. Oh, it's a little bit heavier. Let's give it a try, why not? Okay, soul rifle. Um shoot. 
Whoa, that's a cool looking one. Oh, but we have a better version. Sure, let's give it a try. I don't have any revenant assault rifles. Do I? Oh, that's what, what no, that's what that one is. Okay. The Avenger. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I will probably. Oh, should we put a mod in? No, no scope. Jeez. Increases the damage. Hmm. Okay, so that is a rare one. Sure. And then maybe... Ooh, sure. That's good. Let's see. The Black Widow! Yeah, let's equip the Widow. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. Give us, oops, more, more ammo, but a little bit more weight. Oh, shoot, my weight, wow, my weight, weight, weight really went up. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, oh. Damage. So all the rare ones are some sort of damage. Hmm. Hmm. These are already in use. Sure, we'll put a gold one in there. I mean, I'd like to try the sniper rifle out if I get a chance, but I'd have to put together a profile for it. Mm. Okay, so my dog was barking, so I had to be quiet for a second, but I've made a, um... Last time I, when I was trying to get through the Asari arc, I made an explorer favorite, but I keep forgetting the Omni grenade isn't like an it requires materials or something, and I don't like that at all. So I'm going to not use that one ever. <laughs> but I did, I mean, it created, it had one from each ability, so I figured that was the best, that was the best profile for that. I just made an infiltrator one with tactical cloak. I just got the assault turret and energy drain. Which, assault turret was one of my favorite things about the uh, tech specialty in the original trilogy. So <laughs> I forgot that it was there. I was like, whoa! <laughs> so I got it. But I still have this this one, my Adept, which is, should probably technically be the Vanguard. Um, but uh, it's on the Adept. Uh, I really like to have the shield because when I dash in and do stuff, it's nice to have the shield. Plus it does damage to them. It bounces the weapon, the energy back or whatever, bounces the projectiles back. So it does damage to the enemy and I can kill them that way. It's great. It's nice. So... I seem to, and this is this is another bit more of a long range one that I can mess with, but I should probably redo that one. Uh, let's see, we'll remake we'll remake my explorer one. Everything in Soldier requires a power cell, except concussive shot and turbocharge. Temporarily vents weapon heat via armor to improve thermal clip efficiency. 
Boost weapon, firing rate. See, the mo I like the idea of the traps and stuff, but they require objects, and I don't have the time or the inclination to worry about that. I'd like to use barricade, though. Let's see. I mean, apparently you can get increased power cell, like you're gonna get it get up to three instances of it. It's really cool though. Like looking at the little little video they've got, which is super cool that they include that. I really like that. Let's you let you see exactly what instance you can use it in. I mean you could change it up I'm sure, but it's fun. But it's not just a shield, it provides extra shield regeneration. Hmm. I don't know, it's cool, but I, I'd use it more as a shield regen than a than an actual, like, I'm gonna plop this down and shoot you. Like, how long does it last? Probably not very long. Hopefully it gives some sort of indication of when it's going down. Oh well, we'll get it. We'll try it. Put that in the middle. Uh, get a biotic ability. Hmm. I could try out Singularity. Or Shockwave. Shockwave's a classic. Yeah, why not? And then... Let's put Flamethrower. Oops. Cool. Finally got the profiles figured out. Sorry, it took a minute. Alrighty. But let's actually, let's put on... Hmm. That should be... The Sentinel. Let's actually fix that really quick. And then we had tag with the energy drain. No. Oh wait, I guess we were. There. So we have Sentinel, Infiltrator, Explore and adapt. And I want to use the adept profile. Sure. Yeah. Nope. Did I mess it up though? Oops. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Didn't mess it up. 
Alright. Oh, hi. Park's waiting for us at Forge nice. Greenhouse. That thing got new parts? Do you have more info on where the transport was taken? You follow me out there? Got it. it. Yeah, I am. I missed that conversation. Where are we wanting to go? Oh, let's go get this really quick, I guess. Tell me about this Ephra guy. He's special, a unique, once in a lifetime leader that understands strategy, the enemy, and the fight is hot. Under his command, we see more success against the Ket. Angara greatly respect him. Good enough for me. Okay. Can I jump to this? Doesn't look like you can walk to it anyway. I don't think I can jump to it, but uh, I'll give it a go. Ooh, nice, I did. Look at all this floor, I don't even know what I need it for. It's just sitting on the surface. Isn't that great? Ooh. Look at all this stuff. All right. <laughs> goal now is uh, let's actually I guess let's select on drag Oh, wow. Have I been all the way over there? I get, I have, look at that. <laughs> what was over there? <laughs> but I, but I missed that one, okay. I don't even remember driving, oh, I kind of remember driving around here. Eladin is the one that I remember the most. Or no, we're not. Are we in Eladin? I don't know where we are. I don't know what we're doing. Don't ask me. You're much larger than the rest of the initiative species. You'd think that'd help. Don't trust small people. Do anything to get their shots in. Ha ha ha! Don't trust small people. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. Look, I'm here I'm here to try to help the situation. If I can. This is beautiful, I love it. Ooh, oh there it is! Yay, there it is! Woo! Ahead. Scavengers dug into the sand. Right outside the sinkhole. <sighs> right outside the Why isn't that doing anything to you? So, Morda's still pissed off at the Nexus. You'll want to be careful around her, kid. It's amazing they managed to set up any kind of working colony on this hellscape. Amazing or crazy. And the Krogan seem to be a bit of both. They seem to have really made something nice for themselves, though. Neat. 
they have a gorgeous view. Krogan can survive anywhere though, so. Let me just make sure, yeah, okay. Like all paranoid about the ambient audio and stuff now. New to Chanka. What really? R right there. Really? They're gonna set up that. That's one of the things that doesn't make sense to me. Are you gonna follow me over to the Krogan? Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. New to Chanka coming up. Yeah. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Look at this! Holy crap! They really have built something amazing. I'm gonna save. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Can I talk to you? Move along. No outsiders. She's with me. Human Pathfinder. Drag. It's been a while. Jorgle Struck sent me. I'm supposed to talk with Morda. So now Strux is friends with the Wow, Nexus. that was a really stupid thing traitor. to say. Think I'm a traitor too. Shut it, Breck. I'm not here to step on any toes. I can help you guys out. You assume we need Yep, I knew that was gonna go badly. Wait, you guys did your job. Now stand down and let them in. But Drag, didn't I tell you to shut up? I'll spread the word. Whoa, he's blue. Knows you're here. Good. He's a blue Krogan. Look at all these Krogan. Pathfinder must think she's pretty tough to just stroll in here. I wonder how long she'd last in a real fight. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll fight you. Fight, fight, fight. Saw the worm bust straight through an old ship. Not a scratch on it. Some think it's invincible. Doubt it. Not to a Krogan. Soft, squishy human like you should probably steer clear of the wildlife out there. No wildlife. You said something about a worm. Not a worm. The worm. Huge. Invincible. You can't miss it. I've seen it. It pops out of the dunes from time to time. Plows down everything in its path. Do I have to worry about it attacking? As far as we can tell, it doesn't care about us one way or the other. But stay out of its way. It'll barrel right through you, tear you to pieces. Thanks for the heads up. Thanks. This is so cool! Besides, what didn't weren't we fully aware that this was like a secrety type thing? The terminal of Dr. O'Care's data was right next to the scrubbed ones. Don't worry, Dr. Gunnar. I'll track it down. Ooh, Dr. O'Kear! I didn't why do you have O'Kear's data? Real genuine Baron jerky. Huh. Got a weapon that uses special parts and isn't worth paying for expensive repairs on. Got a custom microfabricator and several hundred years of experience getting old guns firing again. Maybe you need a chemical spun augmentation on the stock, or maybe an internal reskin of your barrel can help. Reskin of your barrel can help your firearm stop pulling to the right and give you the accuracy you remember. It uses blah blah blah. Ingredients for gingerbread cookies. I had these before we went into Crown. I can't stop thinking about them. Pretty sure I got the name right. They're either a sorry or human, and they don't taste like much at first. Just kind of sweet, but they burn the back of your mouth after you swallow. I need more. I wrote down the recipe, but there's stuff I can't get here. Ginger, it's a plant. <laughs> I guess it's a plant. Nutmeg, not a nut. Also a plant. Cloves, part of a hoofed mammal. Cinnamon, I have no idea what this is. Maybe misspelling it. I think it's a shelled animal. I can get everything else. Offer upon delivery. Copy locked issue of four Nix fifty two plus up to four gingerbread cookies. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Should have known Morda would take over. She'll run this place into the ground. Bad karma naming it new Tachanka. Oh yeah, I think. Uh, 
hello. I, I noticed you were listening. Uh, is it because you're a fan of the Krogan genius, Dr. O'Kear? I'm frantic because a terminal with all his research was accidentally sold to a junker. Um, no. Maybe. What was on it? His work regarding Krogan physiology and the genophage was advanced. I was his protege. Or, I was acquainted with his protege. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it's encrypted. But it would be bad if it fell into the wrong hands. I can give you a nav point and the name of the scavenger I accidentally sold it to. I know who Okira is, but we'll see who this is. You talk about Dr. Okira like I should know who that is. Dr. Okir was on the leading edge of Krogan genetics and possibly curing the genophage. And not using the slow genetic mutation approach the initiative has invested in. I have, I had a collection of his He research. wasn't trying to cure, cure the, the genophage, genophage though. The Send me the nav point and the terminal identification. Done. I hope it's still on the planet. The Junker was aggressive. Hey, what? Okir was like, we're gonna overcome the genophage by making sure that we still have it because curing the genophage is useless. Like, he was like crazy. Like, he didn't want to cure the genophage, though. He wanted to overcome it by having it and being strong despite. Tried one of those blue mushrooms? Bad idea. That Krogan just jumped! He's. Oh, he's. <laughs> He's like, I tried one of those blue mushrooms. He's like having a seizure. Oh, man, look at all these Krogan. Just let me go out there with you. You'd only get in my way. Ataraxia is no place for a rookie. Hmm. Any new mods? What you looking at? It's a nice view. It really is. Look at all these birds they've got. Oh, so they built it into the sinkhole, too. Wow! Wow! That's... That's really amazing! Wait, is that Morta? That looks like Morta. Nope, not gonna talk to Morta. No, 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 no. She had, like, a crown on. That's a bad sign. Hey, you. Come take a look. No. I'm busy. And that's the other way out, I think. Looks like the greenhouse is in here. I love the freaking banner type thing they've got going on. Provide shade. Nice. Is this like snow? I mean, it wouldn't surprise me on the interior for it to still have snow, but geez. Just clean my armor and it's already dusty. The Krogan are blue! That's so cool. Some of them are blue. I like that. You know, I'll see you about Araxia. Yeah, out here. Pretty wild out there. They'll kill you for a tire if it's the right size. Just scavs being scavs. We ought to check it out, actually. See if we can get in on the action. <laughs> I'd rather stay here, thanks. You call yourself Krogan? Yeah. Got some questions. Yes, this is genuine Baron jerky. Not some garbage I came up with that tastes, that kind of tastes the same. Got a full crate. Cleaning services. Ah. Updated, updated. Of course it's cloned. You whiny bunch of fortune. I said it wasn't textured proteins. I never said it was original meat. It's built from a template of preserved tissue, though. You can ask a scientist it's real very meat, even if it never hung on a bone itself. Now, quit whining. You know what you should do is you should let somebody test it. You know what I mean? Like, just one person test it and verify. You hear Garak and his team trying to fight the worm? Epic battle. Got in a few good shots before it killed a lot of them. Dumb bastards. Always had more quads than brains. 
That's awesome, though, because it's, it's basically like, uh, I mean, for them, it would have to be similar to the... Oh, shoot, I can't I remember what it's called. You know what I'm talking about, though. Or on Tachanka, the Thresher Maws. The mother of all Thresher Maws. I'm trying to... What? I... What? What? If you head out worm hunting, let me know. I'll plan your funeral. I want to go worm hunting. I want to go worm hunting so bad. I better be able to fight those things. Oh, wait. Hmm. Where's the greenhouse at? I thought that was Morta up top. Where is she? Is she... Hmm. The greenhouse is so nice, though. And there is snow down here. Probably because, oh, I'll bet you it's because it's shaded down, like, in certain areas down here. It's shaded no matter no matter what. Like, all year round, it's shaded, and so the sun never <sighs> has a chance to melt the snow. Hey, I know those jams. I got those jams. Drac, sir, you're here. Settle down a second, Hark. Meh. Sorry. This is just more excitement than I'm used to. I tracked the stolen transport to one of Elodin's moons. You need to take your ship. Nothing we've got has stealth. How did they steal the transport? I had the security system off while I was transferring a new sample, and, well, they snuck in from the far side. Morda thinks Vorn took transport for a sample run. I didn't tell her otherwise. If she finds out what really happened, she'll fry your quads over a low fire. I know. Thank <laughs> you so much for helping me. Okay, let's go. My coordinates should drop you just close enough to sneak in. What are we walking into? A group of Nexus exiles. They're hiding out in an old complex up there. Nexus exiles. Friends of yours, Drac? We made a lot of friends during the music. Ha <laughs> Guess we'll find out. Uh, this should be fine. Hmm. Yeah, it should be fine. I feel like I should do this first before talking to Morda, even though technically Morda doesn't know what went on. So it won't matter. Like, it's not gonna garner me Let's any keep favors. Let's a surprise as long as possible. Until we shoot them all. Right, <laughs> Ryder? Yeah. Yes, Drac. Until we shoot them all. <laughs> yes, Drac. <laughs> Ooh, this is cool. This place is a dump. What do you mean? They don't even have a lookout on the back door. Most people wouldn't complain. Be nice to have some kind of challenge. It's the least they could do, making us come all the way out here. We got rain on our faces. Asses. Over there. Guessing that's the colony's transport. Yeah, that's it. The seed vault better still be on board. And if it's not? I tear this place and everyone in it apart until we find it. That was the original plan. Hey, Jaws like, uh, <laughs> you brought him along. This is your idea. This well, hang place on. is pathetic. Told hey. you so. Uh. Oh man. Guys are barely worth the ammo. No, pull out the other one. The sniper rifle. Uh, Ooh, you move fast. Uh, 
You shouldn't have checked our transport. Oh, come on. There's not a whole lot of cover out here. at the worst time. Come on out. Are you stuck or something? Shotgun's not my babe. Your passion for combat is admirable. <laughs> <laughs> not much about me that isn't. <laughs> if you say so. Let's see how many more enemies. That sea vault better be intact when we find it. place really is falling apart so long as it uh, apart, so what we're basically we're doing this whole time is feeling bad we're gonna end up feeling bad for them is what we're going to do is the goal Oops. Oh. Marlo strike team successful stole a large transport from the Crown colony in Aladdin huge thing just like the boss said contents include weapons and seas currently docked in moon yard B boss is on site to see the salvageable Krogan may want it back. Here, darn tootin, they want it back. Let's see. Anything of... Well, what it's gonna be is... Oh, man, maybe... Whatever this place is, it's been abandoned for a long time. Wait, okay, we so they just... We may be in another galaxy, but I'll be damned if this ain't a mining operation. I believe it, 100%. So this isn't this isn't what they built. This is something they found. Doesn't look remnant. Is this, is yeah, this, this place was a major operation back in the day. Looks like it's been out of commission in a long time now. Okay, we've we've fully we've fully explored this topic, I'm sure. Interesting setup, though. Very windy. Or refinery. Been centuries since I've seen anything like this. Yeah? That's right. Abandoned for a long time, I'd say. Oh, this is Angara! These are similar to ours, then? Yeah, kinda. Definitely a similar setup. Okay, this is Angarin. That makes sense. Sam, can you clear up that comm signal? I will attempt to do so. Is there like a storm? Oh, there is. Look at that. Just, just now. Cool. This is cool. Oh! 
Around. Oh my gosh, I thought that was Reyes for a second, and I... Get it together! Stop them! Wait, Whoa. I hear a roll? Does that mean Spenda is involved? It'll explain how they got the codes to the transport. Oh! We're gonna have a friendly little chat, you and I. Yeah, you're gonna run now. You're gonna leave your Angara friends behind. Looks like someone's holding a grudge. I'll teach him a thing or two about how to hold it. Sniping is fun too. Wait, reload or get more. Yeah. This is awesome. This actually reminds me of some of my more favorite, like sort of side questy, random planet side stuff from Mass Effect 2. I like this. This is a good one. I like this one. What? <laughs> About time they got organized. You get way too happy when people shoot at you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I see you. A lot of interference oh. down here. Oh crap! Find your quads yet? Oh crap! I forgot to change to the to the sword. Somebody else behind us? How about you learn to aim first? Oh, hey. Oh, crap. I forgot that I hadn't changed. Still on my vanguard settings, not my infiltrator ones. know where this guy went. Timers. He's just used to doing things his own way. Hmm. Of 
reports of breach from Southern Pass and the DR, multiple casualties, transport stowaway, AWOL, raising security status, shoot first. Hmm, is there a way to get around this? Can I go through here? Get to it then. Let me go down. That's the way it came, though. There's still no way over there. Oh, now on this side it has the grating, but on the other side it didn't. Can I, like, biotic that stuff? jump up and around and climb around it, but... See, on this side it doesn't have the grating. Oh, I guess I could climb up. Okay, I could climb up that way. Okay. Alright, cool, cool. So we're finally gonna catch Spender red-handed then, huh? Uh-oh, there's some Adi. Oh. I got the initiative recon helmet, nice. Guys, they, they aren't even out yet. Oh, they are now. I need to change my loadout and get the Asari Go sword. Fighting and fight, you quadless bastards. Turret. Oops. Come on. Ah. I 
controller is like sticky. I don't know. Take that. Good job, little turret. That's it. It's fun to switch it up. Switch up the profiles. Yeesh. Over there. What? I see a path on the other side. Okay. Maybe if we move this, we can get through. Lift the rubble. With my hands? <laughs> Thanks, Drac! Holy crap! I have biotics. They are regrouping. Like that's gonna help. Hello? Hear me out there. I know ah. that voice. It's our botanist, Vorn. Pathfinder, Drac, it's you. No wonder the pirates said they need reinforcements. Why are you here? I was on the ship doing inventory when the pirates stole it. It happened so fast I couldn't warn anyone. Right, quit messing around and get down here. I would, but I had to lock myself in one of the containers to keep them away. Pretty sure they want me dead right now. Eh? They're gonna take the transport away? Of course, they're warming up for liftoff. Huh. We don't have time for this. Guess they figured out why we're here. We can't let them get away. Colony's doomed without the vault on that transport. They are determined to take us down. Transport or Vorn? We've got to make a move here. What? Oh. Ah. Uh. You know what the colony needs. Just point us in the right direction and we'll get things done. We need the seed vault, but it's useless without the kid. Then we go get him. Oh. Oh, okay. Born, we're headed your way. Okay, that was not what I expected. That was cool. I liked it being on not my decision where to go. Yeah, cool guys, don't look at explosions. <laughs>